So what is going on guys, this is Ryan here and welcome back to another episode of Thief Simulator. Guys, it is that serious. We're still we're climbing the ranks to become eventually the top thief of this land. If you guys didn't see the previous episode, we're now starting to finally get close, okay? I said we was about this close, but now what? Oh yeah, we're like this close, boy. We're once again back though to Thief Simulator because I think now we're actually starting to close in the final few missions of the game and there is an actual ending you can accomplish from doing all this. And so because of that, guys, we're gonna be, of course, continuing the missions we're doing and uh, just one second, okay, let me cave my roof in. Let me just, uh, there you go. However, guys, right now is the, uh, I guess, giving season and rather than people giving me presents, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take them and I really shouldn't have done this now. This is stupidly cold. See, as a thief, I kind of give my own gifts to myself, okay? If you don't like that, then don't be a thief. But if you do like that, then, uh, you know, take inspiration from me, basically. Okay, I'm gonna have to cut that there guys. This is really cold and it's probably gonna take like three weeks to sort this out Okay, if you like the video, uh, you know what to do. Okay, let's get some gameplay So welcome back anyway guys to the world of Thief Simulator If I remember correctly in the last episode, we got some kind of like car cloning key things So basically we're gonna go ahead and steal someone's car. And that's the sort of Christmas gift I'm talking about. Okay. Yeah, you hear that? Your car's next boy. Yeah, I know he heard me. Look at him Bro, why are you coming my way? You want to You want a box right now? You want to go? Oh he just wants to walk past. Okay, fair enough. So we are looking currently then for house number 205. And I think I roughly recall what it looks like. And I'm kind of not looking forward to burgling this one. I think the defenses for that house were actually insane. So uh, yeah, if that's anything to go by, this is going to be a very, very tough mission. 205 is just here. Yeah, this is the one I remember. God dang it. Okay, we've got some parking just here. So go ahead, spin around. There you go. Now let's go ahead and check... Bro, what are you talking about? You need to stop the car to exit. Uh, I, I did. Wait, hold up. I remember this right now because the dude was just standing in his courtyard doing nothing. I'm going to mark the camera there. So we've got a camera position. How are we going to get this one done, though? Okay, keep checking around the place. So lock picking level two, not too difficult. Camera right in front. You can't even enter through there then. So that's off limits. Let's keep checking around. Another gate just here. Bruh. Another camera. Look at that. Okay, the power's going to have to go down before we even try and break in. So let me just check around the back of the house. Okay, there's a light source back here. Maybe like a back entrance or something? No. Nope. Um, okay. <gasps> what the freak? Bro, this dude is right there. Tenant routine? Bro, that's like a security guard or something? Hey, uh, when you finish work so I can break in. So how are we going to break in this property? The power is always up. I have no idea. Unless the only way we get in is by getting caught, which makes no sense. Surely it's not as simple as going on this rock here and then jumping over, is it? Okay, so I'm on this rock here. Hold up. Can I jump? We shouldn't be here right now. I feel like that was... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we shouldn't have done that, but we did, so we're not questioning it. We're already in. Now we got to find a way, I guess, to like the first floor. Stick around the back here, nice and close. <sighs> so there's the guy, but I need to break into electronics level three. I don't have that. Dang, okay, there's a back door here. <laughs> Yeah, there's also a camera there. That's great. All right, mate. Yeah, whatever. Okay, take me. So we know there's also a camera at the back door, so uh, another round. <sighs> Guys, I started this episode feeling really Christmassy, like I was going to get the gifts this time, but uh, this ain't going so good. I'm just saying. <sighs> We're going to try again, I guess. Oh, wait. You can climb here as well? Okay. Hold up a sec. Hopefully the guard isn't, like, right by the side of me. <laughs> He's not. Okay, the only problem this time, guys, is I don't have the other guard marked at all. I don't know how he's patrolling outside. I don't know where he is either, so this is going to be risky. So this camera, Yay! let me just see. So there is maybe a small window? Nope, there's nothing. We can't get through. Great. Bro, there are cameras everywhere. This is insane. Wait, hold up. If I remember correctly in the last episode, we acquired like a climbing skill where we can climb like guttering. Does this house have any? Yes, it does. Guys, we can go ahead and climb this. This is our way in. All right, so we've established that. I mean, the rest is history, okay? Let's get it. Okay, now we can see the key moving. Just open this one. I'm thinking, okay, what, uh, you know, what other goods you got? Bro, you got that U-tab? Yeah, my tab, you mean? Okay, so this is where Mr. Torres is with the car key. Is that upstairs or downstairs? If I sneak slowly, I should be able to maybe see. Ah! He's right there. I can mark him, but I can't quite clone it. Look, I can't get to it. The dude has it, like, in his shoe or something. How am I supposed to do that? Because I don't trust that. He's, like, waiting. I could potentially sneak in, scan it, and then get out. But I don't know if he's going to, like, spin around, you know? This is so risky. So why is Banister to disappear like that, you know? Let's try this. Nice and slow. Okay. I can't do it right now. This is confusing. Wait, hold up a sec. So quick slot. There we go. I need that. That's so stupid, man. Okay, so let's go ahead and equip this thing. Can we get it? I can see it. It's, like, beeping. Not enough. I think I... Wait. Is that it? Am I good? <sighs> Mr. Torres, you stupid piece of crap, okay? But I love it. So steal the Vulcan Spectra from the garage of 205. This is our last objective, and we're pretty much done here. Now, uh, uh, what the freak were you even staring at, you tub? Dreaming about taking a bath? Look, go ahead and do it, okay? I'll take your car in the process. All right, where's our man going, okay? I need to get to the garage. His lounge, though, that is dope as freak. Wait, has he gone outside? You going for that midnight stroll, okay? That 6.30 a.m. stroll? Okay, well, that helps out because I think he owns his house to himself, so uh, let's go ahead and do this. Okay, where's the garage at? Gonna find the garage, and then we're all done. 
It's gotta be around here somewhere. What? Cameras inside as well? Oh my gosh. Okay, look, we probably can hide. Uh, keyword probably. Uh, I can't find nothing. Oh crap. Oh crap. He's right there. Okay, I gotta go upstairs, all right? If I hide, I should be good, but I don't know where his garage is. This sucks. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, and then this was the room. Go. Hide, hide. I don't know if this is gonna work, guys. This is freaking intense, though. I'm just gonna Google something quickly. Uh, I mean, this is really intense, guys. Hold up. Uh, I think I'm... <laughs> okay, usually we just wait this out, guys, and we should be okay, but we'll see on this occasion. They might find us. Okay, so I think the police have actually given up, and the dude is about to go around the back of the house, and they get stand guard. That's good. So all we gotta do now is find that spectre and get the heck out of here, which is proving difficult. Okay, so now the camera's marked, we can kind of see the, uh, I guess, radius of it. Actually, hold up a sec. Security panel. If we can actually deactivate this, we're good. Okay, so that needs to go. That needs to go. I think then both of these... Wait, what the freak? You disconnect all of the ones that- Bro, what the- Right, that's it, guys. I'm done. I'm gonna find where the car is, and then we'll go from there after, because I can't do this. Here? Nope. Uh, I have no idea where his camera is at all. <laughs> ah, this looks like a garage here. It is. So it's toward this side of the house. Got it. Okay, guys, so again, we just simply wait for the strangest cop in the world. Uh, he just runs around, doesn't check her room, and apparently that's him doing his job. So much so, I think the guy's done. Um, okay, now he's just standing there, so he's pretending that he's doing stuff, and- Okay, so we know where the garage is right now. How do we access it? That's what we've got to figure out. Aha, this side here. So the garage door switch is right there. Close that nice and slowly. But the other problem we got now is how do we get out of the gate? Because there's usually like a switch hidden somewhere around the house and I have no idea where it is right now. No point opening the uh, garage, I suppose, because that's like another way we can get caught. So where is the switch? We've got to find this first. Here, open that slowly. Mr. Torres, can you go ahead and take a seat whilst I go ahead and burgle your house? Here, open this slowly in the bathroom. I'd probably do something like this, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, Mr. Torres, why haven't you done the same? We can just about slip around here. There's no way we're getting towards that side of the house, then. Oh, man, I wonder if that's where the switch is, though, you know? Take a quick look. I don't see it within this room. Oh, man, come on! Slowly close that door right there. Let's check around upstairs. It's gotta be somewhere nearby. It has to be. If not, I think what I'm gonna go ahead and do is actually purchase the ability to uh, see where it is in the house. That is, if you even can. Because I'm gonna be looking for a very long time otherwise, guys, and I have no idea where to even start. Oh, I know I want that coffee machine, so let's get it. I'm done. He's gonna catch- Who the freak is this dude? Why has he got like men in black also in his house? What is going on? <sighs> guys, I'm gonna go ahead and do some recon. I'll be right back. All right, guys, and in doing so, there's literally nothing helpful here. So, um, yeah, this is fantastic. Right there. Guys, that's the gate switch done. So we know that's there. Uh, antique statue, heck yes. Okay, now all we need to do is get the thing from the car key and then we're done. So hold up. I gotta re-equip this. See, this is good though, because now we've made progress regardless and we know exactly where to go. So, okay, hold up. Let me go upstairs nice and quick, because I think, yeah, he gets alerted. Hi. Heard by the tenant. That's fine, that's fine. Let me just move on. Yeah, you stay paranoid, you freaking dingus, all right? Yeah. I don't know where I was going with that one, guys. I'm being honest. Okay, he stood there for an awfully long time. If I remember correctly, he was as well last. So if I maybe get this the right that's it. So I got it. Close the door nice and slowly. Don't need to make any noise. Okay. Now, if we get on out of here nice and quickly, we should be okay. Remember the way I worded that as well, guys? I said should because we probably won't. Camera right there. We'll mark that. That's the anti phone. I'll take that. He's moving backwards on himself. So if we go through, this might be it. Hold up. Close the door nice and silently. Hello, beautiful. Okay, open the door slowly. We just simply enter the car, I think. Uh, I don't know how this works, guys. I'm being serious. Okay, so with the key reader, interact. Yes! Okay, look, we're so close. Hold up. Open the garage switch. They're both distracted. So if we go now, we should be okay. Go, go. Oh, the car starts nice and quick. Heard by tenant. Look, I don't care. If I get out, I'm good. Look, cameras can see me. I don't give a crap. Handling on this thing is weak as freak, though. I can't even... The fr I can't with... What? The car is stuck. I can't reverse or anything. The heck is going on? Um, the car is just completely stuck. This is stupid. As is the tenant, clearly. So, um... Yeah, you want your car back or something? I, I actually can't take it. Uh... This is like an awkward Mexican standoff, right? Uh, what, what the freak is this in the middle of the road? Hey, man, so I kind of took your car. Uh, can you put the gun down, by the way? I just want to talk. Yeah, it won't go in reverse. I'm not sure what to do. So, uh, can you start the thing up for me and can we... No, no, okay, fine. I can't drive the car. It's completely froze. This is so stupid. What the heck is going on? Like, serious. Um, I guess I gotta get caught then. This is like the dumbest thing I've ever done. <sighs> okay, guess we'll do it again. By the way, Mr. Torres, why have you put plants up there? How do you even water those, you illogical man? I mean, I guess it looks nice, but seriously, those plants are like deader than my future. Okay, beautiful. Look, this time we're gonna make that clean getaway. Okay, got this thing started. Let's go. Okay, so heard by the tenant. That's fine. As long as the handling is good, I see no problem. Okay, here we go. 
So I think that must have been the problem because now... Oh, here we go. We're out, baby, and we're taking this beautiful thing with us. Like, this is gonna be worth a pretty penny, right? It drives a lot quicker. Like, can we just make this our new getaway car? Just, like, give it a new paint job so he doesn't know? That sounds like a plan to me. Okay, yep, the handling on this thing sucks, and thank God we're out. Come on, right now. That should be top stuff, okay? I got the air trank as well. Like, what can I say? What can I say? Okay, close that down. Yo, Vinny, that was difficult, so give me that sweet phone call, okay? Vinny, I need praise. What's going on? Straight up with the steel painting replica from 202. Like, no pat on the back. No, thank you. Yeah, screw you then, Vinny, okay? Okay, let me check Black Bay for the antique. So, 8K for the gramophone. 50? What the heck? All right, I'm gonna go ahead and sell that. I just made, like, 20K from that mission. What the f- Yeah, I do want ads. I can't say that. Okay, so the next mission in the story is to steal the painting replica from number 202. And I think we've actually been in that house before. Hmm. In fact, no, I don't think we have. So, 201 is back here. Uh, yeah, just watch out for- Oh, my God. Okay, 202. 202 is at the top here, and we do have, like, a parking spot to sleep. This is a house I've never burgled, so this is about to get interesting. And looking at the fact that it's on a hill, yeah, they got money. So then my next question is, why the freak they got replicas and not the real thing, you know? Oh, man. This property is going to be nuts to try and break into. And uh, talking of nuts, I think I nearly broke mine falling down the cliff. Moving on swiftly, let's try and find an entry point somewhere around this house, okay? Oh, come on, man. Jump for that, grab it, and climb it. Jeez. This guy's so lazy, he's a thief. Okay, I'm checking the full perimeter, so there is a guard on duty. I can't actually mark him either, which kind of sucks. Unless he maybe comes this way. Mm. Now he's gone again. Ha. Huh. It's gonna be tricky, dude. This is gonna be real tricky. Ooh, okay. Here we go. So a climbable fence. Bro, this house isn't a house. This is actually a mansion. Whoa. This is gonna be crazy. So the painting is up down here. Um, so yeah, that's the thing. If I mark this guy, we can see how many guards the place has, all right? It's got three. Maybe I can, like, post up behind this rock here. Or uh, maybe I can't, you know? Okay, hang on. Hold up a sec. It is the festive season, so, like, if I show myself, will they be a bit more remorseful? Wait, hold Freeze. up. But I got no one to spend Christmas with. I just wanted to... <laughs> What is this place? Honestly, I should have just assumed that there was going to be a load of cameras. That's kind of the catch with this neighborhood. So let's just keep on the low and look around whilst we can. Okay, we'll go this way here. Don't see anyone. Okay, there's another camera there. You see, they have a lot. This could be sketchy. So we're going to mark this guy here. There you go. I think he actually saw something, but we're okay so far anyway. Wait, does he literally stand guard and not move? Because that's going to be very, very difficult to get around if so. Look at that, look at that. You dip out for a second and you get spotted. So there has to be another way around this. There's like a small... Wait, seen by a camera. There's another one somewhere? Oh, wait. Okay, yeah, the Kona vision is there. Got it. Yeah, well, whilst I'm waiting, let me first of all pop that open. What's so special about this room here? So that's the car gate switch to get the place open. Okay, noted. Uh, okay, now what the freak do I do? Your officers, yeah, he went that way, okay? Just the guard on duty, don't question nothing. Wait, the car's just stopped. I think I'm good. Like, are you actually kidding me right now? He's right outside the door. You can hear him thinking like, mm. Okay, I think the game's bugged because he won't go away no matter what, nor will the police. Uh, I'm just gonna get this done, okay? It's not working. <laughs> okay, guys, I've had to come back to the computer. I need the tips for this place because this is very difficult. House security tips. Yeah, give me all that good stuff. At a time, I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy stuff for 207 as well, the Fosters, because I think that mission will probably be next. Anyway, the camera control panel is on the second floor to the stairs. The switch to open the gate. I think we've discovered that one already. The windows control panel is next to the front door and the windows have a glass cut detector. This is gonna be tight. I don't think we're gonna do this I'm being real. Is there actually any other way we can get around this? Like, there's a small ledge of dirt here. Can we... We can't climb that. And it's a one-way ticket in, so once you climb over, you gotta commit. Unless, hold up one second. I have, like, a small idea, even though it might not help immediately. Got a glass cut sensor, so I can't even get in that way. Dang. Okay, my man's eyesight isn't too good, so if I get this done quick, we should be okay. Okay, that's unlocked. I gotta be quick. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, he's still standing guard, so open the door. Bruh. Why is it gonna be an outwards opening thing as well, you know? Okay, we press the gate switch, okay? We get the heck back out. Okay, excuse me, I gotta run, I gotta run. Okay, we're in the clear, just. Now, if I go ahead and sleep for the next six hours, let's go ahead and see what their routines are. This is sort of stuff we gotta do now. It's a lot more convoluted and difficult. Like, for all I know, I could be trying to burgle this place at the absolute worst time. No, my look as well, that's probably the case, okay? I'm just being real. We'll sleep until about 6 p.m. and let's see what's popping now. Burglary just I literally ran down the road, and they discovered the burglary. Yeah, let me just mark them, though. Okay, so tenant routine discovered. We can again just simply see where they patrol. This sucks. Okay, I'm testing some stuff out. We could run around the top here, go this way here, and then probably get Freak. caught. Yeah, just like so. Nice, nice. Burglary discovered. What the freak? I've now got, like, a bug. So whenever I start the game again, the guy just somehow realizes there's a burglary. Freeze. Crap. So because the door is always open and he starts in there, it's always going to be the case that they find a burglary every single time I restart this checkpoint. So that really sucks. Let me just double check. So he walks away. Um, okay. 
Maybe not in that case. Interesting. Okay, so let me actually try this method of sneaking around the top. I have no idea if this is going to work, but that's the whole point. we got to live and learn. I feel like he's definitely going to see me up here, because it seems too obvious. <laughs> wow. All right. What if I run across quickly? Okay. Yep. That worked. And then I could maybe sneak around the back here. Because his back's to me. If he starts seeing me, I'm going to get really annoyed because that wouldn't make sense. Hey, okay, and he sees me. Great. Yeah, I don't understand this, guys. This is way too convoluted. Holy crap. I just ran for it and I made it. This is ridiculous. It's just a lockpick in level one, so I should be able to get this, I think. Let's go. Door's open. Are you freaking kidding me? Slowly does it. How the heck? What the freak are the gnomes looking at? Get out of here, all right? My painting. Okay, and you gotta carry it. This is actually a joke. I got no chance. Let me place that down there a second. I think... Someone sounds real close, all right? I don't like that. It's a cottage by Picasso replica. Are you actually kidding me right now? Look, I don't know. Okay, he's going over there. <sighs> this actually sucks. I gotta try and mark him quickly. Okay, come on. I missed. Are you freaking kidding? This is like the stupidest thing I've ever done, but I'm feeling like whilst he's in there, if I sneak around here... Um... <sighs> okay, now at least I have the dude marked, so I gotta wait. He's gone back. Now is my chance. So if I simply go ahead, press the switch, I think I'm good. I can't cut this because of the glass cut sensor. So maybe I should wait for him to walk a little bit further away. Yeah, definitely. Oh crap, he's coming back. He's coming back. So is this his new patrol route? Oh boy. He has no idea. Look, I'm like breathing on the cement on the other side. Look, just get the freak back to your normal post so I can do this, okay? Okay. And he listened. Bro, he just stands there. This sucks. Bro, and he see me. I'm not gonna be- <laughs> Okay, so they call this game Thief Simulator. I'm starting to realize this is actually like a sanity simulator, okay? Or rather, insanity simulator, because I'm losing it right now. They react to noise, so if I have to, like, throw this over there... Nah, they don't give a crap. Okay, he's moving back. Good, good, good. So if I keep moving this way here, I gotta be super snappy, guys. Let's go. Okay, throw the paint in there. We're making progress. This is so painful. I think I'm gonna get caught. I really do. Okay, so he's going that way there. Take the painting again. Throw it over there. Come on, go along. Not like that. Come on. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. <sighs> Guys, I actually just did it. Don't you dare. I'm not doing nothing. This is my painting, okay? Don't judge. Just because I'm wearing black apparels, don't assume I'm a thief, all right? I'm going to whisper that in your freaking ear, okay? Okay, just get the freak in my car. I'm out. Because I'm thinking right now, if I don't hurry up, they're going to go ahead and call the police. And then if they call the police, I'm going to fail. And if I fail again, I don't think my sanity can take it. Oh, man. Finally, we managed to do that. Let's just go ahead and go home. Woo! And it was worth, okay, 1600 but no XP. I don't care about that D rating. Okay, we're gonna sell that thing back out. Vinny, it's good to hear your voice. Speak the to me, last man. The house has the best electronic locks oh, around. gosh, okay. But make sure you're ready. Mm -hmm. this job matters. So we're on to the final burglary place in the whole game. And that's it all done. Wow. Okay, guys, well, I'm gonna go ahead and leave this episode here because this took way longer than I thought, okay? Nearly an hour and a half of recording for two houses. Yeah. Apparently, we have one final house that we got a burgle after, and I'm just assuming this one's gonna be, like, the ultimate difficulty, so I'm gonna save that for its own video. There is, like, a few things I wanna do alongside it anyway, so, I mean, we gotta kill two birds with one stone right there. For this video, though, guys, this is where I'm actually gonna leave it here. I guess we did get some festive treats in the end. You know, I got 26k. I think I'm posting this video as well on the 24th, so if you're celebrating Christmas today, I hope you're having a good day or even tomorrow, but if you're watching it after the 25th, then this is a bit awkward, isn't it? Either way, though, guys, if you did enjoy this video, why not drop me that like rating, and hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I, of course, hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one.